school? Yeah. All right. Um, what most people don't know, uh, and really, like, I, I know like four people in this room, so none of you know this. Um, I actually started out as a piano player. Um, I started taking piano when I was eight years old. And so, whenever I get a chance and actually have time to sit down and learn a song, um, I, I enjoy playing it. So, these two are actually, uh, I, I'm going to do two songs, obviously, that's why I said two. Uh, these two songs are, are ones that didn't actually make the record. Um, and, and I just want to kind of explain to you the way, just sort of the recording process operates. I'm going to take this off so I don't have to twist my leg, uh, not my neck, not my leg. Um, Basically, my past uh, life for a year and a half, uh, I would wake up at 4 a.m. Uh, because I had just given up a job with Benefit, so I had to start working at Starbucks because for 20 hours a week you get full benefits, and that's awesome. So I'm a big Star Starbucks fan. Yeah. Yeah. The first thing I did is I did a Starbucks zip code search as soon as I got here. Sorry, that's totally a random tangent. I do that a lot too. Um, what was I talking about? Oh, recording. Okay, so I'd wake up at 4 a.m. Um, I would go and work at Starbucks till around noon. Uh, I'd go home, I would shower the, the smell of espresso off, and then I would go sit in a writer room uh, for the rest of the day till about 6, 6.30 and write. And basically a writer room um, is, is a, I'm trying to find a reference point in here. It's probably about the size of what that piano is in right there. Sometimes there's a window, sometimes there's no natural light, and basically for the next three to six hours, our job is to be creative and um, write the next Christian hit. <laughs> um, whatever that means, I don't, I don't know. Um, so for a year and a half I did this. So there's a lot of, lot of music that I, I, I had the privilege of just being a part of um, that, that no one has had a chance to hear because it's not on not on an album anywhere. And so this is one of those songs. And, and one of my favorite hymns has always been the hymn, um, It Is Well With My Soul. And, and really wanted to write just sort of a, a reverent song, just sort of a very hymn-like 